everyone, welcome back to my channel. Today is Manic Monday where I show you all my whips and what I've been up to this week. So, I also promised you that I start my mystery diamond painting this week. Yeah, that did not happen. Nope, because I really want to get this one done. So we're going to start off with my Christmas collab painting from Treasure Studio Arts. This is what I've got done so far. As you can see, I only have a little bit left at the top. And this is the bottom. So that is my um, Christmas collab painting with Nana of Seven Crafts. So this is what I've got done so far. As you can see, I'm up to the top. I'm almost done. I have one row left. So I'm going to try to finish this tonight. So in the comments down below, I want you to tell me do you think I'm going to get this done or do you think I'm going to procrastinate and not get it done today? We'll find out because if it's not on tomorrow's live, you know I got her done. So this is um, my Treasure Studio Arts. Um, I don't think these were the new drills even though they thought it was but I'm pretty sure they are not. Um, they're still the old stock because it came in the old box as well. Um, I find that they're not popping too bad, but the, the black is popping a little bit here and there. But it also could be because it's such a big canvas and I'm moving it around a lot that it could be causing them to come off. I don't know because when I run my hands through right now, I don't feel anything, but I'm not sure. But here I can see like some are raising up. But you know, I wasn't very picky with my black that I was putting down. So I don't know, but like here, it looks amazing. The drills look all, all smooth. So it is what it is. I did put a little bit of sparklers here on the candle. I don't think it was enough to make it stand out, but we'll see when it hangs up on the wall. But as you can see, the detail of this painting is, am is amazing. And it looks so, so good. Like, I'm running my hands through it. Nothing's popping off. It's good. It's good. It's good. But I think the quality could be um, a little bit better on the black. But other than that, it's not looking too, too bad. But I still don't think these were the brand new drills that she had gotten in. So that is how it looks. Um, one thing I like about Treasure Studio Arts is the detail that Rachel puts into her canvases are amazing. And I just love it. I just love it so much. It looks really, really good. I feel like that shouldn't be there and I made a mistake, but that's me. <laughs> I always say these things and I don't know. But that is the one canvas that I'm gonna be working on for the rest of today. Um, my next one is another Treasure Studio Arts. I got a lot of Treasure Studio Arts in my queue right now. And this is the wolf for the wolf along that I have not even posted anything for it yet. Um, I will after Wednesday's uh, um, whip and chat. I will uh, post how much I've gotten done with the hashtag and all that jazz. But as you can see, it's turning out really good and I'm going through it pretty quickly because it is round and I haven't done round in a really long time and it was really fun to do. Um, I really want to get that Christmas one out of the queue so I can start a new one and then maybe eventually I'll go back to that mystery diamond painting. But I was going to do it last night but it's like I looked at the section and it was confetti city and I just, I just couldn't, I just didn't have the brain power yesterday to even acknowledge that. So last but not least is my Craftably that I've been having a little bit of problems with this canvas, but rest assured there will be another Craftably coming to my channel very soon because I want to see if their canvas looks a lot better than it does now. Um, some of the symbols I can see clear as day, but there's a lot of them with the white background that I find very, very hard to read. 
Um, I started this section here, but I did not get it done. As you can see, I wanted to get this whole row done, but it didn't happen because there is a lot of confetti on this painting. So, and even though it doesn't look like there's a lot of confetti, but there is, there's a lot of color changes. You know what I mean? But as you can see, it's turning out amazing. So obviously I'm putting, I'm putting the diamonds where they're supposed to be because it's looking like a picture. It's looking like a horse. It's looking like a war horse, don't you think? I really, really, really super, super like this one. And I can't wait till I get it complete because I want to try to get this one out so I can do my dragon. And I want to do my Gloria West from uh, Mystical Diamonds. Those are the two that I want to do next in the queue just so that you guys get a little bit... Um, excited about what's coming what's coming to the channel so there's going to be a diamond art club and there's going to be a mystical diamond being brought into the queue as soon as i can whip out the craftably and my christmas one which i'm hoping to get my christmas one done today but you guys will see tomorrow if i'm not working on it so I would like to know down in the comments if you guys think that I will. But now we're going to get up in closey time with the updates. Be right back. today's bullet journal so a lot of people are doing planners like I always said I went a different route because I like to be different and I'm doing bullet journaling and this is my take of bullet journaling for my YouTube channel only it's planning out so that I can stay on track and get you guys all your fabulous videos for the week so this is this week's it's not very eh. It's not one of my best ones, but it's okay. It does the job, right? Um, so Monday is Manic Money and Shadows of a Channel, which I'm going to do right after this. I have a good channel this week. Um, I'm going live tomorrow at 12 p.m. It's going to be 12 p.m. because I have nothing to do. Stay at home order, you know. I have nowhere to go. Wednesday, I'm going to have a bling bling Wednesday chat. Hopefully, I have something to talk about. I don't know. Uh, Tuesday is going to be an unboxing from another Christmas gift of mine. So, if you guys watch my channel and you pay attention, you'll know it is at Diamond Art Club. And um, Friday, I'm going to do my weapon chats and shout outs. Later on today, I got to post... Um, the shoutouts on the Facebook group. Remember, vote for yourself and vote for one more person. If you're the first person to post, wait a while and then go back and vote for someone. Please, 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 because I'm always having to ask people to do a tiebreaker and I hate asking for tiebreakers. Um, I'm pretty sure... No, that was last week. I'm not sure. Comments, comments, comments. I think I had a good one on Friday's whip and chat, but we'll see. Um, Saturday, I'm hoping I'm hoping to do a post review and uh, the slideshow for the Christmas collab with Nan. That is my goal to have that one done for sure. And my other goal is to work on my craftably and get it done too. Try to whip out those two whips, and then I'll concentrate back again on my mystery diamond painting when I can relax a little bit more because I'm just trying to get the deadlines of the things that are happening in February. Um, yeah, like a lot of like collabs and uh, uh, paint salons, you know, and I just want to, I want to get a little bit involved into the community with those kind of things. So that is what I'm trying to do. So yeah. That is my week this week. I hope you guys enjoy. Enjoy the week of um, crafting. Um, on the weekend, I'm going to try to work a little bit more on my tin. 
And then next Manic Monday, I will show you guys the progress on my tin. I'm going to try to work on it some more on maybe Saturday, maybe later this weekend, like these two days that I have off. But I'm really trying to concentrate on getting some diamond painting done these two days, Monday and Tuesday that I'm off. Wednesday, Thursday, I work this week. So when I come home from work, I'm going to try to work on my craft blade because I'm hoping to have this Christmas one done by today. What do you guys think? Do you think I can do it? Do you think I can get it done by today? We're going to try. I will post it on Instagram as soon as I am done. Um, and then I'll do the post review for Saturday. Yep, that's it. I you know this one wasn't a very good layout. I was being kind of lazy today. Um, I tried to do a triangle with a calendar. I don't know how it looks, but um, I think next week I'm going to use washi tape because I really like the ones that I use washi tape. I thought it turned out really, really good. And honestly, it's kind of a lazy way to do it. And it looks colorful and bright. Right? I kind of like it. But yeah. The thing I like about bullet journaling is I have 2020 when I very first started. So I started, the very first week I started was May 25th. Wow. Of last year. And this is as far as I've gotten. I think I missed one week out of it all. I think there might be a week that's missing. I'm not 100% sure, but I did a lot of things, learned a lot of things that I shouldn't do, like this. That's a big no-no. Never do it again, Liz. <laughs> I really like when I do these arrows and my poop emoji one. Yeah, I just, I'm really finding this a lot of fun. This is when I was using the the gel pens. I really need to buy some better gel pens than what I've got. That is probably my next purchase right now. I've been just using markers because I find if I don't color in, they don't bleed as bad. They don't bleed through as bad. Like to the next page. Like that's not too bad. We can't really see it. I can see it, but you can't see it on camera. So yeah. So that is my bullet journal for this week. It's a full week of stuff, two open chats, an unboxing, a post review, and then today's Manic Monday, and then Tuesday I have a live. So it's a full week. Um, I might bring out my uh, latch hooking. Um, maybe I'll do it tomorrow on my live. I don't know. I'm going to bring it out again because I kind of want to try to finish that bear that I started last year and I have not completed it. Like, we're going to start slashing the projects of 2020 that I did not complete. So, with that said, I hope you guys enjoyed this, but we're going to start the shadows because I got a shout out of a new channel that I just found and I really like it. see from the intro that the shout out this week goes to Crazy Diamonds. She is a new creator on YouTube and I really really like her channel. She does whipping chats. She does a lot of unboxings. She does some tips and tricks. She's done how to diamond paint. She's done a lot of tutorials and she also did the little hand challenge unboxing it is super super funny so go over and check her out because that video had me cracking in stitches i tell you so that is my shout out for this week crazy diamonds new channel i really really like her with that said take care everyone till next time bye
Well, folks, that's it for today's video. If you liked it, please give me a thumbs up. And if you like, please subscribe to my channel. I be super tickle pink. And remember to hit that notification bell and it will remind you whenever I load up a video. And till next time, take care everyone. Bye.